Hey guys, I'm Heath. Uh, I work at Seattle Magazine. I'm kind of a resident beer nerd. Uh, I'm Lauren, and I also work at Seattle Magazine, and I just really like to drink a lot. So, in case you hadn't noticed, uh, Labor Day is over, and we are officially into uh, getting closer to October, which means seasonal beers are very much in style. We've got two different beers here, one from the East Coast, from one of my favorite breweries, Dogfish Head, out of... Milton, Delaware, and then another, a local beer from the West Coast, uh, right out of Woodenville, Red Hook. Brewery, yeah. Red Hook Brewery. He knows his stuff, I know my and stuff. gentlemen. Things are, things are known here. <laughs> uh, these are two uh, different uh, styles, but they are both pumpkin, pumpkin ales, mm -hmm. so we're going to give these a try and let you know what we think. Yeah. Lots of pumpkins everywhere. Which one would you like to start with? Lauren? I think we should start with... The local one, go Why? with the west side. Um, because I like the packaging. I think it's pretty. Am I allowed to touch this? You, oh. Okay. Touching. <laughs> um, so I think we should start with that one, and I want to try it and see what it tastes like. All right. Let's do it. Crack it open. What does it say? Uh, you tell me. Are you... I don't know what that says. Something. Are you ESB arianced? What does that mean? ESB is a style of beer. Okay, awesome. Mm. Good. So this I is traditionally darker than what I drink, but uh, I still like it. Porters are like a darker beer okay. style. It smells good. What do you What do you get out of it? Um, coffee. coffee? <laughs> yeah, no. Pumpkin coffee, coffee e things. Oh, yeah, lots of spice in there, too, okay. like nutmeg, maybe. Nutmeg. A little bit of... Didn't you say maple syrup was in there? So maple they, syrup. Yeah, they do add uh, maple syrup to the fermentation process. Okay. So very nice. Kind of in there, maybe. Pancake-like. Like. Very pancake-like, <laughs> yes, yes. Good? No? Yes? That's a tasty beer. Not too bitter. A little on the sweet side, a little sour. Kind of... Dare I say, like a pumpkin pie? <laughs> say it. It's, it's like a pumpkin pie in your mouth. It's kind of nice. Mm -hmm. I like it. I think my hands are shaking a bit because I haven't eaten much today. <laughs> <laughs> so when you <laughs> fall over from drinking this beer, right, we will right. know that. It's good. I like it. Okay, good. Okay, so next. What do we have next? Next we have the uh, pumpkin ale from Dogfish Head. Uh, this is going to be a little lighter but also still just as flavorful, I think, mm -hmm. if not more so. And I like the label on this one also. It's got a cute little guy eating a pumpkin, or rather devouring, I should say, but it's quite darling, and I would totally drink this all the time. Uh, and it's lighter, which is nice. It's lighter, but it's also stronger, too. Right. This is a 7% beer. Okay, and we're sharing a glass, and I hope that's fine. You don't have germs. <laughs> Okay. I actually think I like that one better. Yeah, this is definitely drier. You don't get as much of the pumpkin nose. No. I want to feel like I'm carving something, you know? Like I'm sitting there gooping out the seeds and getting ready to bake them. I making mean, making scary faces on pumpkins. Yeah, I definitely I definitely get more Definitely get the spice in there, right. but I'm not tasting so much of the pumpkin as like I did in that no, one. No, I want this one again. I'm gonna take this one. All right, well, <laughs> cheers. Cheers. <laughs>